who have been talking about the fact that he does not move. So now that we have seen something that suggests that he's about to move, some of us, we are happy. We are making all the noise. And we also want to share some pieces of information with you. So if you are out there and you want to take advantage of this as a promoter, you have to look sharp. In the UK, they will say promoter. <laughs> So if you want to look sharp as a promoter, then you have to look sharp. Reason, I went back to find some more information to share with you. And I'm going to give you some more details because Shatawale is about to embark on a world tour. And this world tour is about you. It is for you. It is for everybody who has a space and he would want to do something with brand Shatawale. I called him this afternoon just to be sure what this is about. So I can also share that information with you. For you to tap into that opportunity and advantage to host him in your city, to host him in your country, to cash in. My name is Sammy Flex. Welcome to the editorial. And that is what we are about to do. Remember, this platform is being supported by Tap Tap Send. You want to send money from abroad to Ghana? Don't use any other feature. Just go straight on your phone. Get an app that is tap tap send downloaded on your phone, and with this, you're good to go. But remember just one thing to use the promo code SAMIFLEX. Anytime you use the promo code SAMIFLEX, then it means that you're going to get some extra cash on your wallet some ten dollars if you're in US, some ten no five pounds if you're in UK, and five euros if you're in Europe. What are you waiting for? Get this quick and let's do some more. Special thanks to Digital Rasta, who is called Currency, handling our camera, and to which Flex, who is the editor and director of the show. And with you out there, if you have not subscribed to us, you are delaying, as a matter of fact. You have to subscribe because the world is subscribing. And to those who have done that, you guys are our world. We cannot go without saying thank you to you. God bless you for being a part of what we do here on Sammy Flex TV. Now, straight to business. We all know the fact that for some time, we are not hearing much on Shatawale, especially when it comes to his online activities. And at a time that so many things seem to be happening around his brand, but man seems to be mute. He's not saying much. Why is he not saying much? He's not saying much because at the moment he is fixated on so many things that he has been chasing. In terms of business, in terms of promoting his Mali album, in terms of setting up some new things that he has planned to do. I'm sure these are the reasons why man has been ignoring or playing the unlooking to so many issues around him in our space. Now, I think in one of our videos, I shared with you some five main reasons why Shatter has been quite silent and not talking about some of these things. So, I think it was around yesterday in the evening where on his social platforms, we saw he shared a flyer, a flyer that was talking about a Mali world tour. And he says it is a dance hall world tour. That is the Mali world tour, dance hall world tour. And the Mali dance hall album is that album created by himself. That album mixed, produced everything done by himself. In fact, the only feature on the album is the song with Vibes Cartel. Of course, that song has been leading the trend so far as much as the Mali album is concerned. Because this is Vibes Cartel, like the word bass. Now, when you listen to the song, they don't say word bass. They say word bass. That is the dance hall reggae kind of way. And I believe with this album doing well, maybe something he did not expect. Because it is not a work that he really planned for years to do this. Within some few weeks, days, months, he decided to put some pieces together and boom. It was out there. The kind of response he got from it was so amazing that he can't just sit down for the album to die. Because of this, team management of Shatawale, they have decided to extend the reach of the tour to this particular album. That is the Mali album. So this year, 2023, it can even start from next week based on how things are quickly done for them to get things moving. They are starting what they call the Mali World Tour. And it is coming to your city. So far, some of the cities that they have earmarked for this particular tour are United Kingdom, Germany, France, Netherlands, Italy, Spain, Poland, Denmark, Philippines, Singapore, India, Qatar, okay, Korea, South Africa, Australia, Canada, USA, Brazil, Nigeria, uh -huh, Mexico, Belgium and uh, okay, uh, Denmark appeared again here. Um, I want to believe 
Okay, so Denmark, okay, it appeared twice. So Denmark again, Gabon, and Jamaica. Well, I've also seen some flyers running online that suggest that Shatter will be performing in Jamaica. I'm yet to confirm. When I get that information, I'll surely come and share that with you. But I've seen some two shows. Um, I think one on Ironman and another thing like that, which states that. And of course, these fans are sharing that. But I'm yet to get official information from Shatter himself that I can share that with you. But for now, we are talking about the Mali World Tour. So I asked him. One done. What is this tour about? And this is what he tells me. He tells me that for some time, he has been getting calls to come perform in these countries and in these cities. But maybe due to some preparation, some one or two, he has not been able to answer to some of these calls. But this time around, he's ready. At least he has a project that he can even run with it. And that is the Mali album. So I asked him, what kind of tour is this going to be? Then he tells me, this is not going to be like the carnival or the festival kind of tours. It is for people who are ready to host him, people who are ready to have that kind of session with him and his fans in their cities. So for instance, you might even have a nightclub in, say, uh, South Africa. You might have a nightclub in, say, Qatar. You might have a space in, say, Netherlands where Shatawale can come and meet with his fans. Of course, there will be performances anywhere Shatawale is. There is music and there is performance as well. So if only you are a promoter in any of these cities and you can host him and his people in that particular city, then why not? There is a deal. I asked him about the charges and he said, for the charges, it is not high, very affordable, very moderate. All that you have to do is to link up with his management team based in the US of A, that is Fantasy Entertainment Group. Leslie and his people in US, they are ready to do all these negotiations with you. So to you out there, maybe you are a promoter personally. I've been receiving so many calls from some promoters from around the world who would uh, tell me that, oh, we would want to host Shatawale here, we'd want to host Shatawale there. I think this is one of the finest opportunities to do this. You might not need a 20,000 capacity to do this, as in an event capacity, event hall capacity to do this. You might not need a 50,000 event capacity hall to do this. All that you have to do is to get an appreciable place that you think you can host Shatawale to interact with his fans through performances. And this is a big deal to all these people from around the world. I know, like I, I, I said earlier, so many calls. We want to host him, we want to host him there. Sometimes the negotiations alone breaks you guys your neck. But this time around, I'm sure because of how this is going to be done, this is going to be a little appreciable, this is going to be a little affordable, so you guys can take advantage of this. So what are you waiting for? Without much ado, I'm just going to share these numbers with you. Look sharp and hit them, and you can simply tell them that, yes, Sammy Flex is telling us about the Mali World Tour. And in our country, in our city, we would want to host Shatawale on this day at this venue. You provide the details and you talk about the figures involved and poof, there is a deal. As a matter of fact, some of the figures were revealed to me. So even if you want to talk to me that you want me to even negotiate some of these deals for you, feel free and link up. Who knows? You might be in, say, Denmark, and he says, I'm a flesh, can you negotiate the Denmark one for me? I'll lead the negotiations for you, and we get things running. So check out the numbers on there. This tour is going to be managed by a fantasy entertainment group, and they are based in US of A, partners to Shut Up Movement um, Empire. And at any point in time, when you hit these numbers, they are going to respond to you positively for business to go on. But even if maybe their responses delay and you want some flex, like I said earlier, you want me to lead this for you, you want me to start the negotiations for you, why not? I'm open. I'm open to do this for you. Uh, only Kojo King will not go some. <laughs> I'm really open to do this for you. So look sharp. It is the Mali World Tour, the dance hall tour here in 2023. Don't let this opportunity pass you by. Look sharp. I really wanted to be sure of this reason before I came to the studio to do the recording. Decided to hit up with Shatawale. Gave me all the fine details. And like I said, it is not a festival or a big carnival. As much as you have a space in your city that you can start the negotiations, let's get this going. An investment in a Shatawale on a stage 
it's not an investment that you're going to lose. That one I can assure you. I keep telling people that do all your things. Go through all the stress and the struggles to get Shatawale on the stage. But when you get him on the stage, you will know that the job will be done. You would even have fun yourself. I've gone to some programs with him that the event promoters were even having fun more than those who came in to buy tickets. So this is what we can also do. 2023, the floodgate is opened. I know almost everywhere around the world they have been chasing this guy. Just I'm just thinking about some of the places like Singapore, like India. <laughs> it is going to be interesting. But to the... European countries around us, to Canada, to um, America, to UK. Yeah, these are usual places that I know Shatawale has been frequenting. But he tells me Australia. Australia, you guys will have a different deal because I hear Australia is very far. The last time we met one guy called Kofi Shaba who came from Australia to visit us, he told me Australia alone is about some 24 hours on a flight or something like that. So he said, for Australia, there, and nobody can come from. But still, they are open, look sharp. I'm sure, apart from the countries that were quoted on the flyer, if you're in any other country and you also want to be a part of this, I've told you already, either hit the numbers on the screen, that is the one by Fantasy 